What is happening, ladies and gentlemen? This is your fellow paisano, Mr. Reno Zarino in the house, and welcome to another edition of Culture with Reno. Of course, we're going to get into Europa League between Roma, Freynord, and AC Milan, Rennes. Before anything, put a like and subscribe. Tonight, 9.30 p.m. Easter time, 6.30 p.m. Vancouver time. I'll be live with Mr. Richard from Seria Sit Down, and we're going to talk about everything. So I hope to see you all tonight, and we're going to have some fun. Start from the Serie A, Champions League, and then, of course, the Europa League. It's always a great honor to have him there, so why not? Why not? Where should I start, guys? Where should I start? I guess I should start with the CC Milan game. You know, who expect that they were going to win? Rennes, at the same time. They're, uh, regarding to people, that, I don't follow the French League whatsoever. Like, they, they could be tricky, this and that. But this Milan, man, that loved to chick. He tried, he tried, but he did two beautiful goals. Inca, one every 10 minutes, those two goals before the first half. But, yeah, they they managed to do pretty well at this game. Same with Leo, finally he scores. I, I, I'm pretty sure a bunch of Milanisti are happy about now they're going to start saying that Leo was better than kids, Leo this. The same filastroca that I hear all the time, especially with Milan, because now, we're going to hear tonight here on my live that Milan uh, is going to win the school dead to Milan crown. You know, I'm the first one that said at the beginning to my paisano, I don't think that Milan will go through. Yes, they have the team. At the end of the day, you can have the team what you want. You seen yesterday with Bayern. They have the team. But then they have a coach. Uh, I'm sorry. I really liked Tuco, as you people have been following me for a while, but you know, because under Pioli, they didn't click in. You know, now these last three games in Serie A, they've been good. And I did say, Vince, ma non convince. They win, yes, they, but they don't convince me. Today, I can say they, they convince me. But we have to see on the next one. I know people are saying we have to be careful in France, but I'm pretty sure they'll get the job done uh, at the second leg. Then some point they all got injured, so hopefully it's nothing too serious because then I don't want to hear people crying about oh, we don't, we have the injuries, this and that. But is pure, my question I would like to ask you guys, is Peel still on fire? You ask me. Because I know he's in terms to leave. Like he was in this position. We'll see what happens. Maybe he still probably will leave. But what are your thoughts? Because this purely man, I, I don't like him that much either. But sometimes, you know, he proves everybody wrong. Huh? So, you know what I mean? Now, with Roma, at the other hand, 1-1 one, one against Feyenoord. Is De Rossi is a Testa Rossa or something? Like, I don't know what, what happened there. They play, they, like, they manage, because Feyenoord, it is not an easy team. You know? Well, they beat last year with Mourinho. Now, their tie will see at the second leg. But credit to De Rossi. I'm pretty impressed in this moment. We'll see how far he goes. But we all know Mr. De Rossi was the player, so maybe it could be a good connection for the future. And hoping that these guys get some good players for Roma. Because uh, Lukaku scored the second half. There was a first goal from Freynard at the first half. But it was a good game. It is a different Roma, yes, from Mourinho. Because, guys, let's face it, between Mourinho and especially Mr. Allegri, their the, the style is just pff, caca. I said it so many times, 
Loro sono i figli di un calcio che non esiste più. They are the son of a, a, so, of a kind of soccer that doesn't exist anymore. But with this guy De Rossi coming in, and they still will see next week if they can manage to win, because if they lose, they're out. So I think they could win. I think. I don't want to get too sure because Faye know it. But De Rossi got these kids rolling. We'll explain, explain more tonight because I only watched the second half. Unfortunately, I didn't have a chance to watch the full game, completely honest. But that second half was pretty good. And I see Pellegrini more open, so a different Pellegrini compared two, three months ago. So we'll see what happens in the next. Now we got Serie A coming along. I think Milan's going to go against Monza. Then, of course, I forget the other teams. But we'll talk about it tonight. I write it down because I forget. And, guys, that's about it. I'll see you later on tonight. And please like and subscribe. Okay? Bada bim, bada boom. Dal vostro paesano.